in Dodge County, uh, actually by the name of Fremont National Bank in 1871. So we were uh, the longest standing bank in Dodge County. Uh, and then in uh, early 1991, uh, the Lawrenson family uh, purchased Fremont National and, and we operated under that name until 2014. Uh, now we're known as First National Bank. A long-standing uh, uh, bank in Fremont, uh, been family-owned by uh, two different families, but uh, always been very progressive in the community and always had the community in the front of their mind and, and we always want to grow the Fremont area. So, uh, we think our people are our primary best resource. Uh, we uh, also believe that our products do happen to be the, uh, the best in the area as well. So uh, from our free checking account where uh, we can use all sorts of services that are at no charge, uh, have a one annual overdraft protection in case uh, there's a little bookkeeping error and something like that. Uh, and so that is a, a very, very popular in our area. Uh, with the first national footprint over seven states, you can go to multiple ATMs throughout the region and not have any type of foreign ATM charges. And uh, generally there's a location from one of the first national banks uh, in that area very close. So if you need to visit with the person, you can absolutely do that. Uh, our technology, uh, we think, is second to none with uh, mobile banking. Uh, we see a lot more people, uh, depending on their generations of millennials, are more into uh, do a lot more banking online and uh, particularly over the mobile phone. And so our products there are very good. And all of our commercial and egg lenders are located down in our main bank down here on the corner of 6th and Main. Uh, we have our personal bankers and tellers up at our 23rd Street location. Uh, as I mentioned, our drive across the street is uh, tellers for drive up and also for walk-in, and then our wealth management areas across the street as well. In our Fremont area, we have about 75 people, and so uh, we have some that uh, travel to other locations as well and are housed in Fremont, and others that actually live in outside of the community that travel here. And so uh, we think it's a pretty diverse group. Uh, it's always fun to, to see uh, just where everybody comes from and their different backgrounds. And so, uh, yeah, we, we like to try to keep as uh, many people in the Fremont area as we can, and, and that's always been a, a good fit for us. For our mission statement and operating philosophy is we, we want to be able to give back to the community, uh, not only just with the bank resources, but also we, want our, we encourage our employees to be involved and engaged. We want to uh, just make Fremont, the Fremont area, a better place, and so, uh, you know, not only in dollars, but really with human capital is, is, is always fun to to have those people be in, engaged. We want to help better Fremont and so uh, you know obviously as the community does better then there's more opportunity for business for us. Uh, uh, you know that's on the business side. Really uh, personally I like to see Fremont do well. Uh, this is where I live. This is where my family grows up so uh, selfishly speaking I want to see Fremont do very well for that. Uh, closely after that is you know we do have the 75 people that that work here and so uh, you know, I, I guess I feel responsible not only for my family but also for their family. So yeah we love being a partner with the Chamber. I appreciate their history there and want to be a, a partner for years to come and uh, again I think everything that we can, how we can partner is just to help make the overall economy better and uh, keep people moving forward.